no matter who you are no matter where are you from if you follow the strategy which has been told to you in this video you will definitely crack neat 2023 whether you are attempting neat for the very first time or if you are in 11th or 12th standard no matter which segment you are in this video will make a lot of sense to you so stick to this video till the end first all you need to do is an analysis of the score 600 scoring 600 in neat means getting 150 mcqs correct out of 180 and without negative marking so you need to plan accordingly you should also decide how much questions to attempt in each subject based on your strengths and weaknesses most of the students target 330 plus in biology 150 plus in chemistry and 120 plus in physics well and good that will make your score more than 600 your main goal should be such that you are able to get at least 150 mcqs correct in neat now we have made our target let us see how can we make it a reality the interleaving law says that when you are studying two or more subjects instead of focusing exclusively on one subject at a time it can be helpful to alternate between them and most of the students follow this study pattern if they have total of 9 hours to study per day they study biology for 3 uh, hours physics for 3 hours and chemistry for 3 hours and also they believe that complete 3 hours dedication to that particular subject will make them to concentrate and focus much better and once they done with the job then they will move on to next subject but uh, you can also try studying like this instead of spending complete 3 hours to one subject spend one hour to biology one hour to physics and another one hour to chemistry you can ask me don't i constantly have to change my mindset after one hour and also you may think it will slow you down and makes it less effective for learning but uh, our brain don't work in that way when you study one subject during different part of the day your brain knows you need this information during the later part of the day so it processes the information in the background when you study for 3 hours continuously your brain processes the information only for 3 hours but when you study by this method you can process the same information for 7 hours and by repeated practice after a spaced interval you can make your signals in your brain much stronger and it helps you to retain that information for a very long time this is the secret it is better to study for 30 minutes with full concentration than studying for full day aimlessly and human brain can concentrate only for 30 to 40 minutes continuously mhm really then you can ask me then how can i able to watch entire season of money heist in a day with full concentration uh well that's a good question let me build up some story our brain loves images it simply enjoys images with color such colored pictures one after another in a series make our brain get super excited now compare this with your study all you use is one organ your eyes with it you read 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 and read even more do they bring a picture in your mind if the answers are no then it is pretty elementary that your brain simply isn't interested when you are studying so just follow pomodoro technique set a timer for 25 minutes study with full concentration and relax for 5 minutes after four cycles you can take a 30 minutes break this is one pomodoro cycle try applying in your daily routine and you will notice good results guys you don't need any super power or any magic trick to crack the neat follow this simple strategy for biology after watching lectures read ncert multiple times solve previous year questions after that solve neat related mcqs for physics take good notes from lectures read ncert like you read a newspaper understand the concepts and look at the solved examples and solve previous year questions and for chemistry same like physics take good notes from lectures read ncert like you do in biology like reading it multiple times and solve previous year questions for physics and chemistry after solving previous year question you can also try solving ains chipmo je main questions and try solving at least 100 mcqs per chapter 
For revising, don't uh, reread the contents. Instead, close the book and try to recollect the information actively. This is the success mantra and only mantra for NEET. In my next video, I will explain about the complete strategy for NEET 2023. I will explain the schedule, what you need to do each and every day from September till April. So stay tuned and see you in next video.